Hey, it is a very nice Thursday afternoon, and I have, I've been busy today taking care of all kind of stuff, laundry and that stuff outside and handling stuff on the telephone, and I'm going to bathe the dogs and stuff here directly, but I, um, overall, it, it's been a good week. I have been very busy, but been very productive this week. We are, our church is having a significantly large barbecue Saturday. If y'all are in Meridian, y'all should come back and get y'all a plate. Um, it's our biggest fundraiser of the year, so everybody is very much involved in it. And um, so we have been working with that. And <clears throat> um, just been doing that kind of stuff. So it's 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 been a good thing um but let me tell y'all what my what my little poodle did my little psycho poodle did the other day i came home and i don't know where i had been i wasn't gone very long but i put her in the backyard to keep her from sharing her dismay that i left her at home on my floor she sometimes gets temperamental and likes to leave me little presents along the floor i'm not okay with this you see and, um, excuse me, I had something stick on my hand. Um, let me tell y'all what she did. She went outside in the front yard after I came in. I brought her in and I went out the front door to go check the mailbox. And somewhere along the way, she found herself a baby snake and brought it inside the house. Now, this snake was dead at this point. I don't know if she killed it. I don't know if it was dead when she found it. But she brought that thing in my house, y'all. I'm telling y'all, that lizard situation I had a couple of weeks ago, it wasn't nothing on this snake situation. I'm going to tell you, I went to speaking in tongues and hallelujah, and I was ready to put the dog, the snake, the, the couch, the furniture, everything. I was ready to burn it to the ground, y'all. You see, I don't, <clears throat> I don't necessarily like snakes. I'm terrified of snakes. Snakes scare me beyond belief. And so um, I looked down and she had that baby snake. It was a little brown snake. I don't know what kind it was. But, you know, a snake is a snake in my opinion. I know many of y'all love snakes and have pet snakes and that kind of stuff. And um, that's y'all the fair. I ain't going to come visit with y'all, so don't send me no invitation. If you got a snake up in your house or a snake outside your house that you like to play with, I am not into snakes. No way, no sir, no ma'am. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Um, and so anyway, I flushed that snake down my toilet. But then I thought, Lord, I'm going to flush this snake down the toilet. And what if this thing ain't all the way dead? And this thing try to bite my booty while I'm on the toilet or something. I said, oh, my gracious, I hope that don't happen. I, I guess it went on to the sewage system because it ain't, it, ain't, it, it ain't nothing that happened. So, you know, okay then. Um, so we'll, we'll see what the outcome of that is for sure. Um, just, uh, so yeah, that, that snake situation has had me perplexed for a few days now. Um, I, I wanted to tell you, this is a very busy time of year for so many people. This is a very busy time of year here in Meridian, here in town, and I try to be involved in it as much as possible, but Lord, I got to rest sometime along the way. You know what I mean? Sometimes you just sit, ooh, ain't nothing like sitting in that bed, and ooh, you be so tired, your feet hurt, your booty hurt, your back hurt, your head hurt, your shoulder hurt, everything be hurting. You climb up in the big old bed with that fan blowing on your big sex, it be like, whoo, oh, yes, indeed, but anyway, tell, tell everybody that I love them, take my name, I say hello, and I'm going to check in on them sometime here directly now. We love y'all, bye.